Friday, February 26th, the end of the week, and next week will be in March. This Monday will be March 1st, so I am super excited because in March, my birthday, it will be March 21st, and I can't wait because it's going to be a good day. I'm, I'm planning that day to be an awesome day. I went to a superstore earlier this morning, and I picked up a few things because I needed to get uh, iced coffee from Starbucks because now I have Starbucks creamer, so I needed some Starbucks iced coffee. So I also went to a superstore because there, there was these Pop-Tarts bites that I've been looking for. I had seen them at No Frills a couple weeks ago, but I wasn't paying about $7. I think that's what they were asking. So they were on sale this week, $4.98 at Superstore. I was also looking for the Fiber One bars, the lemon, but there wasn't any left. I mean, the whole lemon section was they're all gone. So I had grabbed these chocolate chip Fiber One bars. So these, those are still going to be good. I've only tried the Cinnamon Delights. I haven't tried the chocolate chip, but, you know, it can't be chocolate chip, right? So I also got cheese because there were slices of cheese for $3.98 for, like, a pack of, uh, I'll show you guys, these packs. And they're, like, about, think about 12 slices for like $3.98. I like these because these make great grilled cheeses. And, uh, you know, if I want a sandwich on the go, really quick sandwich, and I don't want to like slice cheese, just take a slice of cheese. It's real cheese, Cracker Barrel uh, sliced cheese. So I got that. I got a few other things besides the things that I've already marked down on my phone. So I'll show you guys what I got. This is just some of the things that I got. So the other things are just refrigerated and uh, I needed to put the other things in the freezer. I got meat. But these are like the things that I got that wasn't needing, you know, refrigerating or freezer. So let's start off with the Pop-Tart Bites. These I've been looking for. These are new family size. There's 10 pouches and they're like $4.98, I think, the whole box. So I got that one and I got the strawberry one. There was two flavors. There's also the fiber one bars. These are the chocolate chip cookie. Can't go wrong with that, right? Remember these like as if it was like yesterday. I, you know, used to eat these. When I was young, I was like uh, eight, nine years old. I remember these like it was like yesterday. And these totally bring back memories. Total of 90s. If you guys remember these, you definitely know these are total of 90s. I guess they got some Life Cereal, but I'm hooked on these. My girlfriend got me hooked on these. Strange, because I never really liked them before. And we needed popcorn. So I got a thing of popcorn for two seventy eight for like six packs. Six, ba uh, six bags, I should say, not packs. Six bags. So that's pretty good. So I got all of these as far as non-refrigerating items. I'm not sure you guys can all see this. I always try to t take a good video so I can create the thumbnail to the dollar store. So I'm going to show you guys uh, the things that I got from the dollar store. A few things that I got from the dollar store because everything else is put away. I don't feel like taking everything out. <laughs> I know I should have like, brought the camera with me, but... I was so tired this morning that uh, I just wanted to go to the store and get my things and get out. I actually just came back from doing my newspapers. I walked to do my newspapers today, and uh, I'm just exhausted. I don't know. Lately, I've been really tired lately, so I've been trying to catch up with the vlogs and the reviews, but it's kind of hard to really focus on both. So I do really appreciate those who still support me through all of these. The thing that's kind of helping me is uh, my coffee, of course. <laughs> Oh, I love it. I need my coffee. So, I'm going to go upstairs in my studio and start editing reviews or vlogs. So, let's go. For dinner, we're going to have some Hungry Man's. So, I'm having this Hungry Man Jumbo Popcorn Chicken with potatoes and barbecue sauce and corn. This looks amazing. So, I got them in the oven. So, we're going to chow down when they're ready. Hungry Man dinner is cooked and I'm going to show you guys my dinner tonight. Got a Hunger Man dinner, got some popcorn chicken, corn, barbecue sauce, and mashed potatoes. This looks amazing. You guys all agree? Let me know. When it comes to eating and when I'm about to eat my dinner, this is what I've always said, 
Bon appetit, everyone. Just got done eating dinner. Now I'm gonna be heading to get coffee because I gotta get my evening coffee. <laughs> gotta love my evening coffee. I normally get uh, a large in the afternoon. If I go in the evening, then I get a medium because coffee, that's a lot of coffee. And the one thing about uh, Tim Horn's coffee I've noticed, I get a lot of acid reflux, so it's like, it doesn't really settle with my stomach. So I try to have less coffee from Tim Horn's than uh, McDonald's. McDonald's I can drink all the time and not a problem. I think it's because McDonald's coffee is a lot smoother compared to uh, Tim Horn's, which is a lot stronger. And uh, I don't know, it's just, I think that's how I feel. I mean, what do you guys think? Do you guys, does it happen to you guys? Does uh, Tim Horns doesn't really settle with your stomach? Let me know if I'm the only one or if I'm not, let me know. It is 7.30 and I went earlier to go get a coffee at Tim Horton's. Of course, that coffee was really good. What I would do is I would bring you guys a review on one of my favorite donuts from Tim Horton's. And if you guys can guess it before I actually show you guys, then you guys are awesome. So my favorite donut, or one of my favorite donuts, is the apple fritter. This is really good. I'll have to try it for you guys. Look at that glaze. That glaze looks amazing. My mouth is just watering just thinking about it. So let's take a bite. Sweet glaze. A nice cinnamon. The nice fritter itself. So doughy. Definitely taste those apples. Really good. This, this uh, donut or set a fritter. One of the best donuts I've ever had from Tim Hortons. It's one of those donuts that works so great with a coffee and. An apple fritter will always be like one of my top three favorites. I'm going to end the vlog here. I still hope you guys still enjoyed today's vlog. As always, if you guys did, and you guys want to show your support for me doing these vlogs for you guys, you guys know what to do. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe as always. And don't forget to ring that notification bell so you never miss a vlog. All my links to all my social media in the description as well. Don't forget to take the two minute survey. That will be in the top of the description. I really do appreciate all of your amazing feedback. So until tomorrow, peace out.